once again to have at our uh, annual meeting no other than Mr. Warren Buffett. Give him another Atlanta warm welcome. Thank you. You are a really um, keen observer, uh, observer of um, economies, of consumers, uh, of behavior, and um, you also, uh, in your um, annual report this year, talked about buying wonderful uh, businesses at fair prices versus fair businesses at wonderful prices. Um, how do you think um, about that in terms of how it contributed to um, the incredible success of Berkshire Hathaway and how you see the next three to five years? Yeah, I, I was taught to buy very cheap stocks. So I'd look at the numbers and, and I, I ended up buying what I call cigar butts. Uh, they, were, they were stocks that were so cheap, they were like finding a cigar butt. It, it, had, it might look kind of soggy and unpleasant, but it had one free puff left in it. And <laughs> so, but the problem with that, of course, is you take the free puff and then you have to go around looking for another cigar butt. And uh, finally, I had a partner that straightened me out and they told me that it was much better, as Buttar quoted, to buy really wonderful businesses at a fair price instead of looking around for these things that had one puff left in them. And if you're looking for a wonderful business, it was hard to beat Coca-Cola. <laughs> so that's why I'm here. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. How do you see uh, uh, the economy shaping in the next uh, three years or so? Well, we've been... And, uh, and the world. Yeah, well, matter. we've been coming back in the United States since the fall of 2009. And, and interestingly enough, we've come by, back at a reasonable, not a, not, a, not a fantastic rate, but a reasonable rate consistently, uh, though from time to time, people have thought it's gonna accelerate a lot faster or that it decelerated, and they talked about a double dip, if you remember that a few years ago. But this country always comes back. I mean, just, just think about it. Uh, you know, if you go back to 1776, you fly, you fly over the country like I did this morning, and there wasn't anything there. I mean, everything has come from this incredible system we have, and, and, uh, and we've still got the secret sauce. I mean, you, uh, this is the mother load of opportunity in the United States, and, and uh, you know, real GDP per capita in my lifetime has increased sixfold. One person's lifetime, six for one. And uh, uh, the game isn't over. It's, it's, it, it, we will always bet on this country at Berkshire. Where do you think the, the growth for a company that has not just one product anymore, but uh, 3,000 products and growing rapidly, where do you think the growth is going to mostly come from, um, in your opinion? Well, I think the consumer is going to tell us that. You know, I mean, and, and they'll tell us different things, perhaps in different parts of the world. But, but you know, every, Every great company listens to its consumer, and, and of course, this company's done that throughout its history. I mean, that, that does not require any change in your DNA or anything of the sort. And, and then you just have to make it extremely convenient for people to buy it. You have to keep the price reasonable, and, and uh, it's interesting. I, 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 drink, uh, I drink classic Coke uh, uh, at the office, and I drink cherry Coke at home. And, and look, you know, it's an incredible combination. You try it. <laughs> Give Mr. Warren Buffett a very warm thank you. Thank you. Thank you.